2014 Sentra 1.8 rear drums and shoes replacement. So the adjuster has to be uh, released and in order to release it there's a little notches on top that have to you have to keep spinning those until it releases the pressure and then once it releases the pressure you can remove the adjuster this is required in order to take the shoes off Next, take the security pin off. Go oh, away well, because okay. you can miss it one piece. All right, so next we expand the shoes, the spring. And be careful with that step. There's a lot of tension there. All right. Clean it with the brake fluid, brake cleaner. Adjuster, cleaning the adjuster also. Make grease. sure the adjuster has grease. If not, add some grease. Or actually, anti seize, right? Anti seize. So the adjuster before you put it back in has to be tightened all the way in so it'll be easier to go in all right next parking. remove the parking cable and those are the new sh shoes at least one side Okay, so that's for one side. Now be careful with that one. Alright, so anti seize on these points, you can see. Just keep adding it to all the points. So adjuster goes in next. Be careful about this step as there is a lot of tension on that spring. It might be easier to put the tensioner while the shoes are outside, so just take them out and put the tensioner and try to fit it back in.
So the safety, that's the safety pin. Mm -hmm. Both sides. And the safety clips. Push it down on the clip from the top and slide it in. So safety clip is in. Now, all right, this is the other safety clip. We gotta put that in as well. Spring for the bottom. Check to make sure everything is in proper place, adjusted. Alright, so next step is adjustment. Just moving on. So we put the drum in. So it's still too loose? Yeah. Okay, so now we start adjustment. So reverse of what we did earlier. Mm -hmm. So how do you know? how much tension to put on there uh, you keep putting the drum back on if it go if it goes on easily and it's loose you need to tighten it a little more but if it's got some uh, resistance it should be okay so so keep adjusting it until uh, it's got a little bit of resistance so we need to adjust it more? A little more. So we we gotta just make it a little bit more tighter. So we can adjust it through there? Yeah. Okay, you can have the drum still on there and adjust it. Through that opening on the drum. Alright, so that's good. Too tight and no, too loose. Alright, so just make sure it's not too tight and not very loose. Alright. Put the rubber cap. Yeah. That's what the not dirty You know the dust. Mm -hmm. Keeps from dust going in. So when you spin this, you know the right adjustment. If you spin it, it, it can it can turn one or two, make two, one or two turns. If it's turning a lot more, it's too loose, and if it's turning less, uh, then it's too tight. And let's go and put the tire back on and tighten the nuts. We're good to go. Brake job's done.